Hello, or to the bay, as people say in Brazil. My name is David Villalobos, I'm 21 years old and I'm from Mexico. I'm currently studying industrial design in my hometown, Puebla, and I'm here to tell you about a really great experience that changed my life and I think made me a better person, or at least more independent. Five years ago, I decided to be an exchange student in Brazil. I remember how all my friends told me, why Brazil? Why don't you go to the United States or Canada? And I always answered, because I don't know nothing about Brazil and I think it has something for me. And let me tell you, I was right. And it was one of the greatest decisions I ever made. So, when I arrived, I was dying of nerves and I kept thinking, what have I done? Ya me de regreso a México, por favor. And it's funny because I remember thinking, it's Portuguese, it's really easy and similar to Spanish. And well, it's not. I arrived knowing how to say hi, which means oi, to the bang, which means how are you, and estou con fome, which means I'm hungry. But it's funny because when I met my Brazilian parents, I kind of knew everything will be okay, and so it was. And well, my first day at school. I will tell you the truth, it was difficult. I mean, I spoke three words in Portuguese and everyone spoke really fast and the classes had a really high level. But I never felt uncomfortable or sad. Everyone was really nice and patient with me. But don't get me wrong, I finished school speaking a really good Portuguese and knowing the parts of the human eye in Portuguese. And, well, never understood a thing in math. But the teachers, well, my English teacher was my Brazilian father, so it was great. About the other teachers, they were beautiful people, always trying to explain things to me and offering help without me even asking. But you know what, I think that's the average people in Brazil. Beautiful people who is up to help you, not minding the language or the culture barrier. <laughs> But school is only one part of the experience. In Brazil, family is the most important thing. My Brazilian parents, Edu y Claudia, are and will always be people who I love. Os amo muito. They teach me so many things. We live so many beautiful experiences and made me a better human being. And the most important thing for me, they accepted me. My brothers and sisters will always be in my heart. And even Jolie, the family dog, even though we have a rough beginning. <laughs> But I'm not gonna lie to you, living in a different country miles away from your hometown is difficult. Sometimes you might feel homesick, but that's okay, I mean your family will always take care of you. So do I have any advice for you? Of course, and it's do it. Live a life changing experience and you will grow and get to know people who will make you feel loved, go and live in that beautiful and spicy country. Você vai ser, vai ser bem-vindo. Bem, disfruta, conoce, aprende e vive. Bye.